Hi everyone and a welcome to my channel. So today I have for you a Holly Hobby haul. Uh, I have been collecting Holly Hobby for a while now. I just love Holly Hobby. Um, I used to have a lot of Holly Hobby stuff when I was a kid and so I've been collecting some of it and I want to use these items in my newly updated craft room. So I want to show y'all exactly what I have found. Um, first off is an item that I that I received from my sister for my birthday a, a few years ago and I absolutely cherish it. It is this super cute Holly Hobby um, pillow. It is very vintage and I absolutely love it. So cute. One of my favorites. So I have that. Next, a picture that I picked up at the thrift store. I believe this came from the SPCA a thrift store. It is so cute. I love the colors and I think it'll be a great addition to my craft room. So I picked that up. Next are some pictures that I got maybe even up to five years ago. I, I really think it was probably about five years ago. Me and my sister were out of town. We went to a antique mall and I purchased these in one of the booths. Um, they actually still had the wrapping on them. Um, first off is this little um, piece of artwork. It is, I think, just probably a print. Nothing really spectacular about this except for it's Holly Hobby. So I would probably want to take her out of this frame and do a little something different with her. Um, I also picked it up in this. So they were $1 a piece and hopefully I can just take that picture out of these little cheapy frames and uh, do something a little different. So I was super excited to find these and for one buck, that was a good price. Next is a um, collector's plate. It says, you've got to have a dream before it can come true. So, so cute. Here it is. I'm not sure what year it is. It is marked in Roman numerals. I paid $5 for this. So cute. Next is a, a item that I purchased off of Etsy from a fellow YouTuber. Um, her channel is called Nesting Haven. Um, she does thrift store walkthroughs and hauls and sells her items on eBay and on Etsy. So um, she, I watched her haul this and uh, well that she showed it in her walkthrough and I was able to purchase it on Etsy. Oh, it'd help if I had it turned around right. Sorry guys. Just a really cute, really muted colors and I just love it. So I'm going to have to find a frame for this. Next is another item that I purchased off Etsy from a fellow YouTuber. Um, the Her YouTube channel is Shawcraft One. She makes the most beautiful um, junk journals and she sells her junk journals on Etsy. She makes junk journal kits. All She does all the things. So I purchased a Hobby a Lobby junk journal kit from her and uh so here it is here is her card um her etsy shop is called my old barn door so um it's just a, a this is everything that you could need to make your own junk journal is what she did with this and it is just amazing. Here's some material. She did a loaded pocket with all kinds of ephemera um, for um, hobby, hobby, hobby lobby. From for Holly Hobby. And you just love it. Um, and this little bag is a, a little collage that she put together, so cute. And some um, little calendar pages that are um, quilt related. 
and then this packet that is full of all kinds of stuff tied together with some vintage lace so um, I've had this for a while but I was saving it um, until I was ready to um, do this haul so um, I haven't even gone through it honestly um, but just all kinds of things to to use in your junk journal so I just love it it's so cute and um, it's gonna make a really cute junk journal so I was excited to be able to purchase this and put it back in this bag so it doesn't hit the floor and go everywhere so I picked up that next is some Holly Hobby I'm going to say it's material, but I really think it is sheets that someone has uh, taken apart to make probably like curtains, valances, um, pillows, that kind of thing. I know back in the day, my mom would have done that. And it is just this um, zipper bag full of material. So I didn't want to pull it all out, but I did pull out some of it. And you can see they, um, they cut it up to um, have just the material. So, so cute. I absolutely love Hobby. Holly Hobby, if I can stop calling her Hobby Lobby. Here's another one. This was definitely a pillowcase. Isn't she so precious? I just love her. Um, here's one this person put a zigzag on. It looks like it was some kind of maybe a pillow or something so and it is really stained up but I just love it so I got that okay and then I picked up this a little jewelry a box it says gather a bouquet of nice things each a day I hope it didn't break Holly Hobby so got that next I picked up this little creamer and it says thankful hearts make every meal a feast so pick that up for a one dollar so cute and then this is the last Holly Hobby item that I have for this haul and this is it and actually we just found this at the Goodwill the color blue was 50% off, so it was $2.50, and I was so excited to find her. Um, um, in fact, I made my granddaughter go back through the store, and we looked at all the figurines because I wanted to make sure I had not overlooked any Holly Hobby. Um, I wasn't even really aware this was Holly Hobby until I um, pulled it off and I turned it over, so... Um, this isn't like the traditional Holly Hobby that I would have taken notice of. So I was so excited to have found that. So many awesome finds. Um, a couple of other items that I also like to collect are these little girls. They're so cute. I just love them. I love their little tear to, teardrop eyes. I, I can't remember what their um, the name of them are, but super cute these are by beverly ann crafts fort worth texas and they were 25 cents each so i picked those up next i picked up this little piece of fabric um, it is like a um, felt and it is petticoats and pantaloons and this is it so although it is not holly hobby it is kind of in that line of um, design and then last but not least this could be holly hobby but i'm thinking it is sunbonnet sue y'all help me out let me know what you think i just love it i love the bright colors of it i've had this hanging in my living room for a while i did um picked this up at one of the local thrift stores and it is so cute but for some reason I just don't think this is Holly Hobby 
Y'all let me know. What do you think? Is it Holly Hobby or Sunbonnet Sue? Anyway, guys, that is it. That is my haul. I can't wait to get these items incorporated into a like gallery wall in my um in my new craft room i have been working in there it looks so awesome uh, me and the granddaughter actually uh, worked in there a little bit yesterday and uh, just put a few finishing touches but i want to do the um the wall um and get that situated before i take y'all in there and share that room with y'all it looks so good we're so excited to be able to get in there and uh, do our crafts and have everything in one room it is so awesome so anyway guys thanks for watching if you've enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up hit the subscribe button become part of my friends here on youtube and y'all have an amazing day bye